welcome back so today we're going to be repotting and adding soil to things so the tomato over here needs some soil added uh, this is looking pretty low as well basil needs some soil uh, this pot right here definitely needs some soil because we didn't actually put potting soil we put starting soil this pepper over here needs some soil as well, also has the same deal with that one. So we're going to start with the tomato over here. Okay, it is a crowded space over here. I gotta say, I gotta make some sort of area over here because it is quite crowded. That's now done for now. Just got to put some water on it and then it's uh, fully good. Now on to the next subject. Oh, don't get twisted on your brother, come on. It's all wilty. This guy just needs a little bit of soil. All right, well, the other plants are over there, so I'll have to stuff the video here and then show you all the other plants when I get there. Okay, on to our next plant, which is, which is kale. A little bit of basil mixed in. Oh, brought this home a few days ago, and it really needs a repot. to our next plant which is our pepper and this one I painted the pot itself and I planted the pepper so with hopes that oh geez got and bury it real quick <laughs> with hopes that will grow to be quite big um, so far it's looking like it will be it's starting another leaf there right. and that should hopefully be good hopefully that's not too much soil <laughs> And now it's time to water them all down, so let me get over there. Alright, now that we got our plants ready, let's start to water them. And a tip for watering plants is you don't want to water directly on top of the plants, because if you do that, you might cause root rot and obstruct the area where the plant is at. This of course will create holes and it's more likely for root rot. Alright, I'm being more careful with this one since there's a small plants in it. All right, and there we go. Now we can put these guys back where they were and call it a vigo. See you all next time.